Just all the questions. Looks like you have less hair yes, this training team. Yeah, I got a, you know, fresh fall camp haircut. You know, it's hot down here. <laughs> Prepare for the heat. How much was taken off? Uh, it was down on my shoulders at one point. Recently, I just took more off, but it was, uh, it was quite the haircut. <laughs> what are you expecting in this camp? What am I expecting? Just, uh, I'm really just expe expecting a lot of guys and me to go out and compete. You know, got a lot of good talent on this team, a lot of depth. So I think the competition in each position and position group is going to be incredible, and that's going to raise everyone to a higher level, and that's that's really what I'm expecting. What's it like coming in knowing that it's going to be like that? Like, there's no cakewalk this year for anybody. Like, everybody's going to have to show up and work. Is that exciting, or is there a level of, like, no, I don't swear, but... It, it, it's, it's exciting. I mean... To get to this level, we're all competitors. You saw us when we were doing the games last year. We all wanted to win ping pong and golf. Like, we're all competitors, and it's no different on the football field. So we're all excited to go compete and go get the job. Is there a different feeling coming into camp this year than maybe uh, years past, just whether it's confidence or heightened hunger or, or anything like that? Yeah, for sure. I think, uh, I mean, I've only been here with one other camp. But as far as this year, I, I just think there's a lot of excitement going in. Uh, especially for me, too, a lot of excitement, a lot of energy, a lot of confidence, uh, excited to get rolling. Brady, for you, how much are you looking forward to the challenge of competing at two spots, and what, what will that be like across the board? Good, I love it. You know, I'm not sure exactly what position I'm going to play, but excited to go compete at all of them, and, and they always say best five play, so going to go try to crack that and, and get a job. What things did you learn from your rookie season that you probably take into this camp? Uh, I just think uh, really taking everything a day at a time, you know, never get too high, never get too low. There's a lot of things that happen in this long season. So you just really got to, it's a marathon race, and you got to pace yourself, and you just got to be consistently uh, attacking uh, every day. And I never get too high, never get too low. What kind of shopping did you have to do to get prepared for this? What kind of shopping? Yeah. You know, I'm, I'm pretty simple, man. I didn't bring a lot. I brought a pillow and a blanket and... That's about it. You know, they got all my football stuff and ready to roll. You guys going to be working with two different quarter, uh, four, but two specifically a lot to see who's going to win that battle and Sam and what um, Sam's going to be able to do in this game. Uh, what's that going to be like for you guys up front? Uh, yeah, it's going to be a good battle. 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 It's going to be a they're both great quarterbacks, and so I'm excited to see what they can do um, when we give them the time to do it. You said you're not exactly sure where you'll line up. Do you have a, an inkling where you'll spend most of your time? Uh, I'm just excited to get out there tomorrow and go play wherever they put me. So that's kind of where I'm at right now. Do you like the idea, you've heard Matt say it, I'm sure Camp has said it, about finding the best five and you putting yourself in that conversation? wherever it is. Yeah, that's the goal. I mean, I'm going to go out there and compete. My goal is to get a starting job. That's what I want to do. And um, I'm just really excited to go compete with the guys. There's a bunch of great guys out on the O-line this year. We've got a lot of depth. And so, like I said, the competition is going to be awesome. Well, you guys took some heat last year. I mean, fifth most sacks in the league. And I mean, how much is it personally for you guys to kind of elevate your game this season? Yeah, anytime someone touches a quarterback, you know, we take it personally. That's I think that's how we all get to this point. Like we're so, we're all protective in nature. And so when the quarterback gets hit or sacked, you know, we take it personally. And, and I think we kind of had this whole off season with that chip on our shoulder and really working our, our tails off to get to the point where we can protect those guys back there and, and do what they do best. Right, we got time for two more. What kind of car did you ride today? What, what kind of car? Uh, I still got my Toyota Tacoma. I've had it for five or six years, you know, classic. Solid, solid, great truck, city truck, but I love it. <laughs> Brady, Matt said that you were one of the most improved, not the most improved, but becoming one of the better players on the team. What's that mean to you, and just what has these last couple of years been like for you trying to improve your game? Yeah, I think it uh, gives me a lot of confidence, you know. Um, that's the goal is to get confidence from your coaches and that they can put you out there and trust you to make your plays, you know, and, that, and that's who's going to play, the guys they, they trust the most. 
So that's what I'm going to go in and try to do. You know, every play, do my job, do my job, be consistent, don't beat myself, you know, do my job, be where I'm supposed to be. That's that's really all you need to do. And, and when you do that, then you, you can kind of let your athleticism take over. But that's the, the half the battle, you know, being where you need to be and, and doing what you need to do.